And backstage at the Ulster Hall with the three classical winners of the Young Musicians Platform Award for this year, Dawn, Sinead and David. You're very welcome. Thank you. How's life been since the last time I saw you? Yeah, really good. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. You really spent all the money? Uh, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Took a trip to Vegas. So <laughs> I didn't. Great idea. I didn't, Great idea. yeah. <laughs> People would say, well, I mean, what, what is the what is the five thousand pounds award? What is it? How far does it go in terms of music at the level that you're working at at the moment? Well, I have plans to go to Germany later in the year. I haven't spent any of it yet. I'm hoping to get some lessons in with a mezzo back in London as well. So I'm hoping it'll stretch to that. I think it will. Oh, uh, similarly, yeah, I'm hoping to go to Italy in the summer and do a month-long course in Tuscany of like Italian language because quite a lot of what we learn in conservatoire, you don't actually learn how to speak the language, you just learn how to say it really nicely. Yeah, I haven't spent any of it yet. Um, looking, oh, looking forward to spending it though, but uh, yeah, it's quite uh, a lot of money to plan to how to spend it. And have you all been busy since the last, the last time we met was you had a beautiful Two recital in Broadcasting House in, uh, in Belfast. Yeah. yeah, just before Christmas. Yeah, uh, well, I uh, got through to the semi final of the Royal Overseas League, which was a couple of weeks ago. That was a lot of fun. I'm working on an opera in Cardiff. I'm in Albert Herring involved in that at the moment, and just been doing auditions and stuff. Um, I'm on a scheme with the London Philharmonic Orchestra at the minute and uh, playing uh, with them and getting involved with their education department. It's been really good fun. So, what's the routine now just before rehearsals? Do you have you know, do you have to set out all your lucky charms in a row and your <laughs> rabbit's foot and all the rest? Or what's the plan? It's not work. Uh, well, we've got a run of the, the whole concert first, so we're, we've got a big rehearsal. And yeah. then there isn't actually a lot, of, a lot of extra time, but just a little bit of chilling out, I think. And yeah, can we do some yoga? Yeah, yoga. Yeah, it helps. Yeah, I uh, get quite quiet before performances and have a banana and then just sort of go into the zone and try and relax. So yoga and bananas. Yeah, yeah that's I mean, brilliant. It's yeah. the secret to success. Yeah. <laughs> this is going to be a brilliant concert. Everything from Mozart arias to Carmen to Arvo Pert. If you weren't one of the lucky ones to get a ticket for the concert, you can hear it on Sounds Classical between 8 and 10, Sunday night with me, John Toll, on BBC Radio Ulster. <laughs>